This is a clip from Basketball at the Bar Live. So, on the subject of the Golden State Warriors, let's talk about the Warriors championship window. I'm going to pull up the roster here. Uh, this is one of the older teams uh, in the playoffs um, as far as like star power goes, but they do have a lot of young talent on their team as well. Uh, Calvin, what are your thoughts on the championship window for the Golden State Warriors? I mean, I, I still see this window being open for at least a couple more years. It, obviously, it depends on how they, uh, you know, navigate these this roster over the next couple of off seasons. They're going to have some difficult decisions to make here, Jordan Poole being one of them. Do they pay him? There's rumors out there they're trying to trade for somebody like Rudy Gobert. Or Cat. Uh, or Carl Anthony Towns. Um, but they've got, not only do they have the stars, they've got, up-and-coming young stars on this team, and they've got assets to mm -hmm. make a major move, uh, like a trade, in the offseason. So I think, of course, a lot of it rides on can Clay and Steph and Draymond all stay healthy for another few two, three years. But assuming that they do, I, I don't see this team um, not being one of the better teams, if not the top you know, three or four teams in the NBA for the next couple of years, at least. Yeah, yeah, I, I can agree with that. I feel like guys like Steph Curry and Klay Thompson, because they can shoot so well, like their game really does age well. As long as they can remain healthy, I think that Klay Thompson uh, is, you know, going to lose uh, his defensive edge here as the years go on, but he'll always have that shooting touch. Same with Steph Curry. Uh, 34 is the age for Curry, 20, or sorry, 32 for Klay Thompson. And Draymond Green's 32 as well. Draymond is the guy that I'm worried about as far as this team. He He's played extremely well, um, but his style of play, I'm not sure exactly how much longer he can keep that up. Yeah, I agree with that, but I'm also looking at a guy waiting in the wings maybe to take over that role, and that's Jonathan Kaminga. Mm -hmm. um, their, their games are very similar. Kaminga is a much, much better athlete than Draymond Green. Um, but Draymond has kind of taken that guy under his wing this year. Yep. I think they, they really believe in this guy. He's got great two-way potential. Um, so he could easily be somebody that slides into that role two, three years from now. Yeah, I mean, they have Andrew Wiggins. He's only 27. Uh, James Wiseman's 21. Unfortunately, he's dealt with a bunch of injuries. You got Kaminga at 19, Moses Moody at 19, yep. uh, Jordan Poole at, at 22. Um, so there are quite a few young guys on this team. It's going to be interesting to see whether they do decide this offseason we need to win another title or two uh, with Curry, Thompson, and Green. Do we upgrade and trade some of these young guys to bring in another proven guy? Yeah. Or do we take kind of like the Spurs route of have the mentor, uh, the David Robinson, bring in the next age and continue uh, this this franchise to make it a, a perennial title contender yeah i see it being more of the latter there this franchise is great at developing young players just look at what jordan Poole has done this yep. season um he really really benefited from playing next to steph curry for the past few seasons um and they've they've got all these guys that you know they were in the g league just a couple of seasons ago juan toscano anderson is another one mm -hmm. um who just they they fit this team perfectly that they, they yep. know how to develop young players and they've got a great system in place. So not only do they have good young talent, but they're going to be in a great shape just because of the way the organization is structured. Another guy I'm, I'm you know, not so much worried about, but I just have questions is, is Andrew Wiggins, right? Like the dude has, has been so much better in Golden State than he was in, uh, you know, Minnesota. He's improved every single season. He, he's on a max deal, has made a bunch of money, uh, next year is his last year of his contract. He's making $33 million. What do you do with him? Do you end up signing him to an extension? Uh, you, you know, just next season between Steph Curry and Klay Thompson, that's, you know, $90 million. It's <laughs> a lot of money. Um, on top of that, of you got $25 million to Draymond Green. Uh, and then, you know, what do you do with Kevon Looney? What do you do with Iguodala, Otto Porter? You know, there's there are a few guys on this team that you might want to keep you know, along with this Warrior squad. So what happens with Iguodala? What happens with Wiggins? Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. All questions that we will we will figure out this offseason. It's, yeah, it's going to be uh, um, interesting to see what they what moves they make. But, hey, they, they've got – it's a great problem to have, right, what, what their situation is like. Yeah. And, you know, 
a lot of it, I think, actually comes down to how they finish out this season, right? Like, if they win the title this season, I see no reason they don't bring the band back for next season and just yeah. try oh, the yeah. same thing right again. But, you know, if they fall apart in the next round or, uh, you know, in, in the Western Conference Finals, if I'm the GM, Bob Myers, I might be looking at the roster a little bit differently in terms of, like, I need to make some tweaks here. I need to do something here. Uh, you know, we've seen guys like LeBron James that have just aged incredibly, but that is not the norm, right? So uh, Mother Nature is is undefeated, um, so we'll see what happens, or Father Time. So we'll see what happens right. with, with Curry, uh, Thompson, Green, Wiggins. Thank you so much for watching. As always, please don't forget to like this video and hit that subscribe button. You can join us live every single weekday, Monday through Friday, 3 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And also don't forget to tip your bartender.